I think the top line is that uh, local businesses are not fully behind the project yet. I think there are big concerns about where the opportunities lie for their supply <coughs> chain and I think the time scale is a real problem for people with uh, 2033 being seen to be too far distant in terms of uh, a delivery time. I think an important part of the business case for HS2 is based upon the economic benefits that it will bring to our region. Indeed a KPMG report for HS2 indicated that the economy nationally could benefit by up to £15 billion pounds per year and the regions being the major, major winners of that. Interestingly our survey has revealed that businesses do not see the benefits of HS2 uh, and don't at present see the supply chain opportunities. I think that's very interesting and also perhaps a matter of some concern. I think the survey shows that we need to work closer with people from Yorkshire, particularly the chambers and business organisations. I think they're in real danger of being left behind. When I'm in Birmingham or Manchester or Nottingham, businesses there are already closely engaging with HS2 around the opportunities. Our supply chain conference, SMEs in particular, over 70% of the businesses there were SMEs. It's a challenge to me to make sure that Yorkshire doesn't lose out. HS2 is for passengers only. It only has two intermediate stops from Leeds to London. Where is the connectivity? It will be for the professional people who have got to go to London. Most businesses, two million SMEs, don't need trains. They need connectivity to get their goods in and out. And that means roads. Around this area in Yorkshire, there's loads of businesses, whether they're railway or construction, whether it's the rail businesses in Doncaster, whether it's Henry Boot Construction, long-term Yorkshire business, and indeed the engineering manufacturers. You know, HS2 will need tunnel fans, it needs belt conveyors for tunnelling machines, it needs construction equipment. All of the businesses in Yorkshire make stuff. That's the beauty of Yorkshire, and they have to understand this is a massive opportunity for them.